So if you want to quickly review recorded footage from one of your cameras using our mobile app, you would open the app and then click on the video icon. Here is the second icon on the top. Then you would add a camera to the app by clicking on the plus sign in one of the quadrants, clicking on camera on the top left, specifying a start time and an end time, and then under record type, choose your camera from a list of available cameras you have added to the app. So in this case, I'm pulling one up from the left of a, a driveway. So on the bottom is a timeline. There's some icons below that. And then the camera's in the top left view. I can double tap on the camera itself and enlarge the video to watch it more full screen. While being in portrait mode, you can then use the timeline and swipe to the left to fast forward towards a certain point in the timeline. In the previous menu, I selected a time frame of 24 hours, so this will actually let me forward for a full 24 hours. Now, the great thing about this is, if you're recording all the time, your timeline is fluid. There are no jumps or pauses in the video. If you're recording only on motion or smart detection video analytics, there might be some breaks or pauses. So if you're not recording all the time, you may find your video to break up and you'll just have to realign the timeline. On the bottom, the icons, there are a few things you can do with them. The first one on, on the left lets you record uh, what you're seeing here to the phone. So I just pressed it, it starts recording, I'm going to stop it by pressing that icon again and it actually saves that video clip into its library in the app. The second one is for a snapshot and then the one on the right hand side is an audio icon that lets you, if your camera has a microphone, listen to audio from it, and the last one actually closes all the channels. The center one is for some of our active deterrence cameras, and it's not going to be discussed in this video tutorial. So once you've recorded some footage or taken a snapshot, you can click on the home screen, and then go press more, file, and here you can find a film strip of your video footage that you saved to your phone or still snapshots of pictures you've taken while reviewing footage. Thanks for watching.